Hello guys, my name is Desert Tiger and welcome to episode 2 of Green Project. I just woke wo <laughs> I'm sorry, I just woke up <laughs> and uh, I'm gonna just eat the breakfast and drink some water. And my breakfast is gonna be a uh, chocolate, <laughs> some nutritions and drink simple water and then what I'm gonna do just get some extra water and boil it that's our bottle of water and we need also wood stuck over here and this is how we, uh, we can boil all right my nutrition Military nutrition is like half eaten, leftover. Uh, we're gonna put the chocolate and I guess, okay, that's it. Um, I don't want to skip anything, so I want you to so see you guys what I'm doing. This way you will know where like all the stuff comes from like oh wait a minute like you ask me oh what's happened to this stuff oh what's going on so you should know that what happened all right it's night time it's one in the morning which is like really bad because you cannot see anything since we don't have a flashlight that's why i call it my flashlight because it's too dark I um, mean, it's not so dark, it's supposed to be, but still dark. So, what are we gonna do? We're just gonna spend some time in the house and figure out what we're gonna do. Uh, first of all, what I'm gonna do, I'm planning to chop some trees. I'm gonna tell you which trees to chop. Because there's a, this is important. But first, uh, let's see what we can do. Uh, we need, definitely we need more seeds. So let's see, go to the farming and see if we can make seed solder. Okay, so we need planks and metal grid and we should have that stuff. Yeah, cloth, metal grid and planks. We have to make those planks. And of course, uh, he suggests to make a water collector, but we have one, the big one. We still have the water, so we don't need that. And planks, we can do in raw materials. And this is what's supposed to be uh, do it yourself. No. Did I miss something? I only forgot what I can do the planks. Raw materials. This is what's supposed to be. Yep, that's the gold planks, and we need the saw and the raw wood. As we have three pieces, and we have also saw in this one. So we're gonna take two pieces. Gonna leave just one. So we're gonna do a bunch of planks. While we, how many planks do we need? First, we're gonna make five planks. So once we last time in last episode we plant the corn, so we're gonna make seed solder, and this is in husband actually in farming. These are our seed solder and required five planks. Okay, so we got that. So we don't need more wood. So I'm gonna just put the planks over here. Put this branch over there too. So I'm gonna take that stuff. So like right now I like I don't have that much space and uh, that we're gonna change because first thing what we're gonna do we're gonna put, put this raw wood and before we're gonna make seed soil we're gonna make use the rope and the branches and we're gonna make chest simple chest do it yourself this is where it's supposed to be chest no uh, furniture A simple chest requires just one rope and then 20 branches. Uh, we have eight, so we don't have enough. So I guess we can do it. So 
So we're gonna make our seed sorter. So let's go to farming again. And we have a seed sorter, so we need cloth, we need metal grid, planks, and a string. And that's gonna take one hour. Which is good because time's gonna go by and it's gonna be bright outside and then we can uh, chop some trees. It's still dark, but uh, I believe I should be able to plant, place seeds sort of somewhere if I... Oh, it's too dark to place. Okay. That's fine. And by the way, temporarily you can store <laughs> some of the items and the tables so like you can like have four slots to store on this table they have also four slots on the butcher table to store some items and there are also some slots to store the items over here and we don't need extra water plus we have that uh, extra storage so we can put that water uh, nutrition we're gonna keep the nutrition just the food and the water always important uh, this we don't need that too and actually this is, comes handy if I want to do what are my crops but this is where I can put my water you can access some of the storages from inside the house which is also very nice okay it's 4 30 in the morning is enough time to do uh, okay so what I'm gonna do just take one extra wood and this is the quickest way to speed up the time if you don't want to wait so just make something simple like building planks or if you can do this there's a water collector that will be next thing on our list because we can have the planks we can get the have the branches once we're gonna start chopping the trees and we have box of nails next to our beloved actually next to my beloved broken jeep <laughs> so let's put that stuff okay it's 5 17 in the morning 5 18 okay that should be sun should be up oh yeah so let's uh, first well that was the reason I could not place seed sorrow because it's uh, dry grass was on the way. So I'm gonna place the seed sorrow. Doesn't matter. You can always move it later on using the pliers, but that will be useful. So once we have all the corns, we can uh, plant more corns. Corns. And okay, so let's uh, just grab that stuff too, lying around. We don't want to do anything, what we don't have to. I mean, like, basically, we, we don't want to waste the energy because, like, you, using that, you know, energy is going to drain our water and food. And we don't have that much water and food, especially the rain is going to. The first rain is gonna be next in two weeks so now it's Tuesday so around two weeks so we have to survive for two weeks with that water what we have and okay so we have to plant some elm trees that's what I said last episode we need looking for the special seed and the special seed is the elm seed first we're gonna harvest thyme and some dried grass and okay so this is the tree and this is a uh, dried dried dead tree elm tree so if you looking for the elm seeds you have to chop this tree so what that means so, okay so let's go to find another tree see there's a two types of trees actually three types so don't chop this, these trees, just ch chop elm trees, dead elm trees, if you're looking for the elm seeds. If you're looking for different seeds, you can chop this tree or even this tree. Then you can uh, 
find the seed and of course it doesn't happen every time and if the seeds gonna be dropped always gonna be one see like this one it's always one if you chop a tree which is still is like a live tree then you will have two seeds all right and we're gonna plant our tree right in this corner so just gonna clear from the dried grass use the hoe was a good thing tree oh this is not the hoe this is the hoe <laughs> tree doesn't require water which is awesome and now what we're gonna do we're gonna chop some branches also from the bushes you can get one lock which is very cool there's another elm tree which we can do that too so we have extra elm seeds if you're gonna find it and also we'll have a time by the way if you chop the live tree then uh, all the stuff which grows around the tree will be automatically like harvested so we got another um, seed uh, doesn't happen all the time so you may chop more trees this is like completely like random thing so if you're gonna chop sometimes you can chop like five trees and don't have any seeds at all so that's gonna grow and we'll have uh, extra elm seeds uh, once the tree is gonna be fully grown and also the elm tree is gonna spawn time and time is good for the our to decrease our radiation which is better than squid I mean square not squid <laughs> all right they're missing something now all right so we have a seed uh, sorter and how many branches do I have 10 I need I believe I think I do have enough to make a simple tiny little chest storage I should say uh, let's see it's in the phone under the furniture menu ah two more all right so let's chop two more two more branches so we're gonna chop them bush and that should be enough Uh, let's make this little simple chest this is cheap one uh, there's another one which is like good looking chest uh, this is a wooden chest it's got required planks and nails it looks nice but uh, well we don't have that many resources so we're gonna use this one but there's no difference between this chest and that uh, nice one, wooden chest. They all have nine slots of space. So now we can put uh, some organic waste. We can uh, finally take all the, our the stuff and start putting some stuff over here. So we have all the stuff comes handy. This way yeah, we can remove some of the materials, also nails. And put everything over here so it's almost full all right also we can leave our saw wooden saw wood saw not wooden saw wood saw we don't need that and we can put all our locks over here and they say about the water collector we have this one with 5,000 water but that not much so let's see farming Water collector, we need planks, of course, some branches. So we have some wood, but we're gonna just chop a little bit more wood, trees. And I always choose and trees. Because if you wanna do oak trees, you just use uh, pickaxe 
you just dig the ground and wait until you're gonna get the oak seeds for the oak tree which is the acorn seed oh, I'm so lucky I got well I got two okay that's enough um, by the way if you want spawn a lot of time you need at least I mean three trees is enough then you have plenty of time they should have plenty of time they can grow next to each other the day don't need to be spread so I'm gonna place one and we're gonna also place one more so we just get cut the dry grass and place one more and that should be enough and of, of course we're gonna clear some area around these trees so we have a higher chance of spawning the stuff by the way, also the beetles are gonna spawn. Elm trees also spawn the beetles. But the beetles, even if the beetles will be spawned, they're not gonna eat the thyme right away. So we have a chance to grab the thyme before beetles are gonna try to eat that stuff. Also gonna make some room for these trees, for oak trees. Because they basically grow the resources, like uh ferrite, clay, and what else, uh, stone, okay, so we all set, uh, we need a bunch of trees again, so we can make start making uh, water collectors, and these, wa these water collectors I'm gonna put outside, and would be the best if you can do like two minimum two uh, if you have a chance be, uh, make three water collectors because we will need a lot of water see so i have all different kinds of seeds And I can temporarily use these containers. Let's see. Storage to store some stuff. And well, seeds I can just temporarily put over here. Right now we have limited space. In our inventory, we have limited space around the house. I mean, in all the storage. But that will change. So now I get time, I'm gonna put over here. And let's make some planks. Because we have the nails, so let's make... Uh, we need 10 planks to make the water collector. So it's mm -hmm. kind of... It's not that much, I mean... But still... We need that. So, okay, we have one more. All right, we're running out of time. So I'm just gonna build two water collectors because we have enough nails. We have 20 planks and we have some branches and we should have the hammer somewhere. Oh, it's not over here. I oh, wonder if I do have, no, I don't have hammer in. So I should move my hammer. No, it's not in here. Yep, yeah, it's right over there. By the way, there's no way to make the some tools. I mean, you can make uh, mm, like uh, so. You can make a hole. You can make sight, you can make uh, axe, pickaxe, but uh, hammer, you cannot make the hammer, you cannot make wood so so make sure you're never gonna <laughs> lose those tools. I mean, they're not gonna despawn, that's for sure. You don't have to worry about that. But I never lose my tools because like you can, I mean, you could drop, but it's not easy to drop till 
tool on the ground. So that means most likely you're not gonna lose the tools. Alright, so we're gonna put the water collector. Doesn't matter, it could be over here. So we can uh, place. That's gonna make some room. Cut that dry grass. And okay, that should be enough space. And this is where we're gonna place the water collectors. Over here, so that's one. This wooden collector is gonna store 3,000 units of water. Uh, the metal one is got 5,000, but to make the metal one, I'm gonna show you uh, farming metal one metal water collector required more resources, which required iron and iron bars and we need special machine plus we have to make a wire and we don't have that machine yet we have to go to the town to get that machine so me i'm just gonna use build uh, more water collectors wood water collectors and i need four more branches see that's our first resources we get the sulfur which <laughs> is not very useful it would be better if we could have like ferrite we don't need the stone because the stone is lying around so we don't have to do look for the stone but uh, ferrite will be the best thing because we can make sharpening stone from ferrite and as you know, may notice my pickaxe is basically it's gone just only one point left on pickaxe and by the way, don't try to use the any of tool all the way down to zero. Because if you do this, you may, and it, if the tool is going to be broken, you could be hurt. And you can hurt yourself when the tool is going to break. So be careful, you just have to watch that bar, make sure it's not going to drop down to zero. And we don't have bandage to heal the wound, so we kind of be like, if we will be like bleeding, we'll have like slow, I mean movements, and then uh, chopping the trees and collecting the stuff. Everything will be slow, and you'll probably be more tired. So it's not a good. good. Okay, we need two more branches. Uh, I saw the bush somewhere. Oh yes, there's a bush. So let's have that. We found the bush. We can have yep two more branches. So we're gonna build one more water collector and call it for the day. Like I said, I don't want to skip anything, so you guys can see what I'm doing and. Uh, this way you'll know what's going on all right so that's our next water collector and basically next episode we're gonna do one more or if we can do we're gonna do like two more because like see we have water and right now we have like less than 3000 units and we already need the water i can drink that water and it's a good idea to drink before you can fill up the water because you're gonna waste that stuff. So we're gonna fill it up. Right click. Since there's a wood over here, you can just right click and start boiling automatically the water. Doesn't matter if anything is over here. So I'm gonna just put the wood. And of course we're gonna eat something. We're gonna eat another piece of chocolate and eat that part of the military rations and it's time to go to sleep so thank you for watching i hope you guys enjoy it and see you next time bye bye take care